One of the more common questions surrounding Elite Dangerous Odyssey's equipment upgrade material gathering is where to find manufacturing instructions. Manufacturing instructions are a data material that is used multiple times in every single upgrade of every single suit or weapon and the randomised drop rate is such that it can seem like they're rarer than unicorn shavings. In this video I'll tell you what missions you need to pick up to give the best chance of getting a drop of manufacturing instructions and if you really don't want to leave it all entirely to chance I'll tell you how you can farm lots of them really easily. There's three main methods for acquiring the all important manufacturing instructions. Two are the way Frontier would prefer you gather them. The third is a method Frontier would probably rather you didn't use but it is far and away the most time efficient. Onto the first method then they can simply be a reward for successfully completing an Odyssey surface mission and whilst the spawn for this mission reward is fairly rare I have seen the reward spawn a fair few times with as many as 5 manufacturing instructions coming from one mission. To find these missions simply look at all the missions in a stations on foot bulletin board and then filter the mission board by material rewards from the top right drop down filter selector. Then page through the missions to see if manufacturing instructions are currently available. You can visit every station in a system checking the bulletin boards like this but it's not terribly time efficient. The second method is to choose a mission type that is quick and easy to complete and has a higher chance of having manufacturing instructions available to gather whilst on the mission. The missions you're specifically looking for are salvage missions that require you to retrieve an electrical component from a crash site. Examine the mission before you accept it and try and find one that is threat 2 or above. I tend to hunt these missions in a low security or anarchy system but they tend to spawn just about everywhere generally speaking. The mission will take you to a downed satellite or navigation beacon on a nearby world and task you with cutting open a panel to remove the target component. These satellites however also have a data panel that can be accessed and that panel has a reasonably high chance of spawning manufacturing instructions as well as a few other useful maps such as topographical surveys. If after downloading the data you extract the component that is the target of the mission then when you leave the POI it will immediately despawn. It's here however that the third and most time efficient method for gathering these mats comes into its own. Instead of extracting the component and completing the mission if you instead log out to the main menu and then immediately log in again the game will respawn the data in the terminal and it carries the same chance of spawning manufacturing instructions or indeed anything else again. You can then rinse and repeat the relog as many times as you like grabbing the manufacturing instructions whenever they respawn. Whilst we frankly wouldn't recommend this method for the best gaming experience sometimes it is honestly just the best way to get those last one or two pieces of data to get you on your way again and it does work. Whilst researching this video I was able to gather about 14 manufacturing instructions in around 30 to 40 minutes compared to one manufacturing instruction that spawned randomly when completing a salvage mission that took about 15 minutes to run through. And there you have it. That's how you can gather manufacturing instructions for all your suit and weapon upgrades. Have you had much luck finding them yourself and if so what method do you employ? Share your results in the comments below. That's it for now. Thanks very much for watching. If you found this video useful consider subscribing to the channel and maybe take a look at one of our other videos linked on screen right now.